This customer wants to hang this $20,000 chandelier on their entry ceiling. The first thing I'm gonna do is mount this perimeter support onto the ceiling after taking it off with these nuts. And then I'll mount the canopy to the perimeter after wiring it. And then there's these little mushrooms that hang down from each location on the chandelier with an LED light that projects up at the goal. So they look kind of cool. It's definitely different. I'm gonna be installing the fixture in that location Location. Because the canopy is so big, I'm gonna have to move it that way so that it's not hitting the sprinkler. I'm also gonna need to install a pancake box because the previous chandelier did not have a fixture box. So after I remove these nuts around the perimeter, the light comes off of the bracket and then I'll be able to mount this bracket to the ceiling first and then I can mount the light to the bracket. So we figured out where we we're gonna put the bracket so it's not gonna hit the sprinkler. Now I'm gonna mount it to the ceiling. After getting these three screws into the joist, I drilled two new holes into the bracket so that I can get two screws into the joist over on this side. Now I got the bracket mounted. Now I can put the canopy up and wire it. So I slid the pancake over the wire and these two bolts that are here. And then I'm just gonna install it to the joist with the screw. Just like that. After getting the pancake box installed, I'm gonna install this hook into the pancake box so that I can hang my chandelier from the hook temporarily while I wire it and then I'll be able to install it to the bracket. So after getting the hook installed, I can just attach this chain to it and then this will be attached to the fixture. So now I'm gonna hook the chain to the fixture and then I'm gonna bring the fixture in and hook it. So after hanging it, now I can wire it up, hands free, and then put it up and put the nuts on. So I'm making all my connections with these Wega wire nuts. And then I'm just gonna <clears throat> put a couple nuts and lift up the fixture and try to pull it up. decorative nuts around the sides of the perimeter. Um, I'm gonna be able to peel this plastic off and then we can install all the dangly mushroom things. All of these uh, dangly things are numbered. So we just need to match the number with the number and then everything should hang in a nice artistic design. So now that I got the plastic removed, I can start installing all the cables to the correct numbers. So I'm finding the number A75, and then I find it up here. And then this piece just goes in, and then it screws on just like that. And I'm gonna do that for all of them, and then I'll get the slack out and let them hang. So now that I have all of the danglies installed, I'm just gonna remove the tags, and then um, take all the slack out so that they hang where they're supposed to. Just like that. I got all the cables unraveled to the lengths. Dimmer on. This chandelier is made by Catalani and Smith. It's really cool how the light projects off the gold plated mushrooms. And that's your end result.